Now we're going to talk about nervous tissue. Nervous tissue is found in your brain, in your spinal cord, and in your nerves. And nervous tissue is what sends impulses throughout your body to control your muscles, things like that. So nervous tissue is made up of two types of cells, neurons and neuroglial cells. The neurons are the cells that actually conduct those impulses and send those impulses throughout your body. Neuroglial cells are the majority of what nervous tissue is made up of. It's about 90% of nervous tissue, and those support the neurons. So we're going to take a look at what a neuron looks like. This is a motor neuron. So I'm going to write and we're going to talk about the parts of a motor neuron that you need to know. This part of the motor neuron with the nucleus is the cell body. So the rounded part with the nucleus is the cell body. These projections off of the cell body are called dendrites. This part Hmm. Draw this a little more clearly. This long projection, and it can be very long. Some nerves run the length of your legs. They can be very long. One cell body is an axon. And the axon runs from the cell body to the rest of where your cell is going to, where your neuron is going to conduct its impulse. This, at the ends of these projections, are called synaptic bulbs. And when you learn a little more about how neurons conduct impulses, you'll learn more about the role of the synaptic bulb. But you'll need to know that part of a motor neuron. So those are the parts of a motor neuron.